G'day everybody, Patrol Gaming and welcome back to another reaction video. Today we're going to be reacting to Isaac Butterfield and the Americans versus the Aussie Outback. Um, you already know they're in trouble. They have no idea what they're doing. So let's jump in. Um, we'll see what our old mucker um, Isaac's got to say. This is a result of a BuzzFeed um, video that they put out. So and obviously um, Isaac's going to rip him a new one for this. So let's go in, um, jump right in and see what the hell is she doing? Um, okay, let's jump in and um, see what's going on. Oh, this poor American's got no idea. Right. I'm quite sure that I've made my position very bloody clear on BuzzFeed in general. Right, let me just turn it up. Okay. Sorry, I wasn't really loud. Commenting on BuzzFeed, the position is fuck BuzzFeed, and that's why when I saw one of their journalists, <laughs> sorry, I couldn't even say that with a straight face, one of their <laughs> fucking the people that work at BuzzFeed venturing into the Australian outback to try and survive, I thought, well, it would be quite remiss of me not to comment on such an absolute tragedy. So why don't we, as a group and as a nation, watch these merry group of fuckwits and take the piss? Hi, I'm Kelsey. So a lot of my friends would probably consider me an indoors person, so it would come as a surprise to most people that I thought it would be a really fun idea to try to survive the Australian outback. Back. Kelsey, I hear you, mate. I'm an indoors person too. Listen, I left the house today before I filmed this for about 20 minutes and got fucking sunburned, all right? I'm pale <laughs> as fuck, all right? And you seem like one of those BuzzFeed writers who produce articles such as this bullshit, or this fucking bullshit, or perhaps even this fucking bullshit. So my advice from an Australian who's 25 years old, props don't go to the fucking outback, dickhead. <laughs> <laughs> You know this poor girl is gonna die out here. Oh, she's from Broken Hill. Okay. Ah, uh, well, I was actually in Broken Hill recently, and oh, if you're from Broken Hill, make sure you turn off the video. Uh, Broken Hill is not the middle of the outback. The outback is like in the middle, not there. That's Broken Hill. That's New South Wales. That's not the outback. Who am I kidding? The Broken Hill people don't have the internet or the means to use it. Broken Hill <laughs> is an absolute shithole. Their number one attraction is a giant chair, pictured here. That's it, it's not even that fucking big. So basically, I'm gonna fly to Broken Hill, Australia, in the middle of the outback. Oh, by the way, I assume she's flying from Brisbane or Melbourne or Sydney airport, and the plane that she's flying on there is a particular brand of plane that I will not name for legal reasons. But when I flew to Broken Hill, they told me about these propeller planes, right? They look similar to this type of plane. <laughs> and what they said was a couple of years ago, one of the propellers actually fell the fuck off. And yes, Holy they told me this. The stewardess told me this fell off? prior what to the leaving the tarmac. Jesus. What the fuck, love? So when I got off the plane and I walked past the pilot, I said, oh, best of luck on the way back, mate. I heard these things fall off. And he said to me, there's always one smart ass on the flight. And I was like, get fucked, mate. You're the dickhead that <laughs> lost a fucking propeller from a plane and nearly killed everyone. It fell down and landed some poor prick's fucking farm. And you're having a go at me. You absolutely... I've become side. Anyway, it's a shit plane. I'm just the things on me. I'll have a little bit of flint at a water bottle. Whoa, 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 what? Whoa, whoa, what? Look how much water she's got. Just wait, go back a bit, go back a bit, go back. Uh, let's have a look at um, how much water she's got for about half an hour, maybe. Things on me. I'll have a little bit of flint, a water bottle, protein bar, just for safety purposes, so I don't pass out. Uh, my name's Colin Clare here at Limestone Station, due west of Broken Hill. How big is your land? Uh, about fifteen thousand acres. Heat mid thirties could range to thirty-eight, forty. Okay, so that's pretty general heat for Australia in the summertime. Uh, but judging by the amount of water you're taking there. You're absolutely fucked, love. Ooh, I'll tell you how else you can fuck yourself over pretty bad. It's not subscribing to this YouTube channel. It's oh, yeah. Go check him out, too. If you haven't watched these videos, go check him out for sure. He's funny. He's very funny. Birthday. Oh, hallelujah, ladies and gentlemen. Press subscribe. I shit you. First and foremost, water. Uh, no water, no life. Hydration is important. Depending on the duration, food's important as well. But I've got to tell you, there's not much out there of either. There'll be bugs out there. Whether you'll be quick enough to catch them is another story. Bugs? Who the fuck eats bugs? I don't care how, you're only there for 24 hours. How hungry are you going to get? Look at that. <laughs> oh my God, what is that? It's a foam. 
Oh, yeah, it's a bone. No. Look, yep. A literal thing died out here. Yeah, it's probably a human fucking skeleton <laughs> because someone from, from Broken Hill was trying desperately to find something to do, and they found dying. <laughs> it's about dying more fun than hanging out in Broken Hill. Oh, Isaac, that's like cruel, that. man. So we've been here for like 45 minutes, I think. And Kelsey's already sort of talking to herself. Look at this pretty thing, though. Look at that. I'm going to keep it. It's going to be my friend. Oh, that's marvelous, love. You have a pet rock. Is it a boy or a girl? Oh, what? They're talking about BuzzFeed here. There's no genders. None. None. <laughs> You're like my Wilson. Although it is Australia, yeah. so I wouldn't be calling that rock Wilson. I'd probably calling it something more Australian, like Darren. What a beautiful name Darren is. That's a... Oh, this one is fine. This looks like something I could use. I'm gonna drag it behind me. I'm doing great! I'm doing great work! I felt like I was doing... That poor fucking tree! <laughs> What's wrong with you, woman? You come along and that tree, the closest thing it's had to moisture in the last 500 years is the tears <laughs> from the poor little lizards that live out there and cry because they're so close to Broken Hill. And you've come along and kicked the bludger. I saw one spark. What the? Hi. You've been there for a couple of hours. How fucking peckish are you? I've been laying here Did for a while. Did you just eat the bug? It's beautiful, but I don't know if I'm really going to get any sleep tonight. I do feel hungry. I do feel tired. I do feel a little dehydrated. But it's nothing bad yet. You've been there for five hours. Shut the fuck up. People in Australia, when they're growing up, they go in school camps which are far more torturous than the situation you're in. We gotta go for three days and lay on yep. some sweaty fucking tent in the middle of summer just to get to know each other. That's a fate worse than death. Good morning. And I just think I found a bug that is quite large to eat this morning. So breakfast is here. He's not, he's for sure dead. Oh, it looks so gross. Okay. Not a scientist here, but uh, I'd probably say you want to avoid dead animals and eat yeah. dead animals. That cricket's dead for a reason. It's probably full of so many diseases, you can't even fucking name half of the bastards. Why is she eating oh, bugs for? No. Oh no, there was like goo inside. Yeah, the goo's probably AIDS, love, and you just <laughs> ingested it, you fucking goose. I haven't found any water. I've hardly there found no any water. bugs. There is no water. We just lucked out on finding fruits. All right, I'm oh. gonna eat those berries. We don't know what they are. Probably. Now, hang on. They could be nutritious and delicious. They could, they could be deadly. Make you die immediately. So we finally <laughs> found an area that looks like some kind of body of water. I'm going to see if I can find the deepest end, maybe. The digging is much harder than I anticipated. Uh, I've been what digging is she for doing? 15 to 20 minutes now. Actually find water. Oh, my God. <laughs> it's not much, but it's something. on did she just drink water out of a hole in the ground now i've 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 seen enough survivor to know that you're supposed to boil that shit yeah. for months before you drink the bloody thing for and months i just like to point out broken hill massive mining town i think you probably just drank a couple of liters of lead kids as the butts man always shit. says boil your water i'd love to eat a hot dog i'd love to eat in and anything out. i would literally like to eat anything i don't want to do this Ah, uh, yes, that sounds like me when I have to watch these BuzzFeed videos for content. We walked for a little bit, and I think I see some civilization in the distance. Are you excited, Caitlin? Yeah. Yeah! <laughs> this is where you get murdered. I don't want to end this video on a bit of a downer, but that civilization that you've just miraculously found looks a lot like the uh, the place that you do from Wolverine to uh, torture these victims and kill them all. So uh, yes. it was great knowing you. Know, you produced some amazing content. <laughs> and uh, best of luck with your remaining moments of life. Well, ladies and gentlemen, that's all we have time for. Oh, my God. But I'd just like to reiterate from the start of the video, fuck you, BuzzFeed, so very much. Be a good motherfucker. Peace in the Middle East. Like the video down below if you have the time because it does help more people see it. And don't forget, we've got my recording of the live special happening in Sydney. There's only a couple of tickets left. Uh, so the link will be down below. Uh, love yous. Uh, be a good motherfucker. Peace in the Middle East. 19 dick eye. I still need to change that. See ya. <laughs> Goodbye. Have a pleasant tomorrow. <laughs> well, that's, um, that's crazy. I, she didn't even spend a whole day in the outback. That wasn't even in the outback. That was out, you know, just the back of somebody's house. Uh, I don't know what it is. People are crazy. 
Um, so that's a quick short one today. So hopefully you've enjoyed it. That's something just a little bit on the fun side. Um, poking fun at Americans, really. Sorry, if you're American and you're watching it, I do apologize. It's just a bit of fun, hey? Um, yeah, but just the craziness that people get up to thinking they um, Australia's like America, totally different country. Totally different country. So uh, I'm surprised you didn't see a snake. But, oh, well, doesn't matter. So hopefully you join me next time when we do another reaction video. Um, uh, remember to like and subscribe um, if you're new. Um, check out the channel. There's plenty of stuff on it. And hopefully I'll catch you in the next one. See you then.